ಇಡೀ ಬಣಗಿ ಪ್ರೀಚಿಂಗ್ ಬಾಸ್ ಟುಡೇ ಐ ಟು ವೇಟ್ ಗಾಸ್ಪಲ್ ಜೋನ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಟೆನ್ ಗಾಸ್ಪಲ್ ಜೋನ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಟೆನ್ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ವೇಟ್ ಟುಡೇ ವೇಟ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಆನ್ ವೇಟ್ಸ್ ಗಾಸ್ಪಲ್ ಜೋನ್ Chapter 10 Words is one on words In this Jesus Christ is saying Most assuredly I say to you He who does not enter in the sheepfold by the door but the kinds up some other way the same is a thief and a robber you born again you did born again come i can pray for you i can pray for you if you want i can pray for you come forth but he who enters by the door is a shepherd of the sheep Praise the Lord. To whom the door keeper opens and the sheep hear this voice. Hear his voice. And he called his own sheep by name and lead them out. God bless you. You want to pray? you want me to pray if you want to pray you can come forward i can pray for you bible says and when he brings out his own sheep he goes before them and the sheep follow him for them know his voice praise the lord i want to say one thing to all the people the people are walking here today i am preaching the gospel that gospel that means jesus christ is a shepherd i got the bible the manifestation of jesus christ happened in this world only for one purpose the people those are living in this world everybody want to get eternal life Praise the Lord. I go to the Bible. Jesus Christ manifested in this world to get eternal life to each and every people those who are walking here. God bless you. I can pray for you. Come forward. Praise the Lord. I am preaching the true gospel to each and every people. The people are walking. Jesus Christ said, I am the shepherd. God bless you. Why Jesus Christ said, I am the shepherd. Because 
एक बार एक और था बाइबल बाइबल से जीसस क्राइस्ट इज अ सेवियर इन दिस वर्ल्ड कर बस ये बोलेंगे जुड़ी बोलेंगे जुड़ी बोट अगेन अरे कोई चर्च ऑन संडे दैट्स गुड दैट इज व्हाट जीसस क्राइस्ट सेड I am the way. I am the life, and I am the truth. I go to the Bible. God bless you. Okay, wish you happy New Year. God bless you. Only when God can direct to each and every people, those who are living in this world, to your destination, in your destination, that is our God Almighty, Jesus Christ. In the Bible, there were lots of people could able to receive the healing and deliverance from the Lord. This all the people they were believing that Jesus Christ is their Lord. Today, when I preach this gospel to each and every people, Jesus can say, "I am the shepherd." Bible is giving only one God to each and every people. That one God, that Jesus Christ, who died in this world, manifested in this world, 2023 years before, 24 years before. Today is the first of January 2024. Are resurrected on the third day, manifested in this world without sin, and took your sin and our sin in this body. And God died at the cross and resurrected on the third day. God bless you. I am preaching the God who is still alive in this world. Brother Lord, God bless you. Bible saying Jesus Christ took our infirmities and sickness in this body and died at the cross for you and me. That is absolutely true. Praise the Lord. Because today, in Jesus' name, healings are happening, deliverance are happening, people are receiving the salvation. People are receiving the healing and deliverance in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! So the people are walking here. Only one thing: I go to the Bible. I want to say to each and every people: Gospel John. Chapter ten. Bible says, "Jesus Christ is a shepherd." Verse the three. Bible says, "To him the door keepers opens, and the sheep hear his voice." And he calls his own sheep by name and leads them out. And when he brings out his own sheep, 
he goes before them and the sheep follow him for they know in this world Oh God! What was you born again? Huh? Did you born again? Who's that? Did you accept Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior? Yes, I love Jesus. That's that's good. You born? Do I can? Did you have been taking water baptism? You want to pray? I can pray for you. Come on. I'm praying. I'm praying. I'm asking. Did you accept Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior? Amen. Did you accept in your life? I accept. Have you taken full water baptism? Yeah. You have to. I can baptize you. I'm the pastor. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? I can pray for you. Tillon. Heavenly Father, I pray for the Tillon right now. Tillon, you need the baptism right now. I pray and bless his brother right now. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Amen. God bless you. I'm going to arrange the baptism end of this month. If you want, you can write your name. Okay, a number. I can arrange that the pastor here. Okay. Let me check up, brother. Now I'm going to take you the pen with me. Okay. Yeah. Write your name and number. Okay. I can invite you. Okay. Right along. Any other people need water baptism? It is available. The month ends. You can join with us. This will be your biggest ceremony in the city. God bless you. Thank you. God bless you. Alan, right? Dylan, yes. Dylan, right? Yes. God bless you. Okay. Thank you. God bless you. I'm Pastor Jolly. Okay. I'll send you a message. So today. Jesus Christ is a good shepherd, and according to the Bible, all the people are walking here. Bible says, "Our God kept able to look after you." Only one God is living in this world and giving one hundred percent promise to each and every people. I can look after you. Do you want again? That is Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. You born again? Huh? Did you born again? Really? Did you born again? Did you accept Jesus Christ, Lord and Savior? I'm good cool, man. Hmm? I'm good man. Have you done like that? No, no, no. You have to then look at look at you. If you want, I can pray for you. Few seconds. You are, you can go to heaven. You want? Can you pray for me if you want? You have to repeat. You can accept few seconds. Jesus Christ, Lord and Savior. You can go to heaven. You want? I disagree. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? Milo. Milo, repeat the prayer. Heavenly Father. I don't know. Not you don't. Want? Not today, no. God bless you. Carry. Okay. I, I, I won't. I won't force you. Okay. God bless you. Carry. No problem. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I go to the Bible. Only one God can get the life everlasting to each and every people. That is Jesus Christ. In this world, eight billion people are living in this world. Out of eight billion people, how many number of people got saved? Out of eight billion people, how many number of people are got saved? Maybe one billion people. Bible is giving one percent, God bless you, one hundred percent guarantee to each and every people about the eternal life. Gospel John chapter ten, Bible says, Jesus Christ can call each and every people by His own name. Bible is giving a clear-cut picture about that Jesus Christ is a savior. Bible says, "As many as received that Jesus Christ is 
Yeah, Lord and Savior. Our God is giving a right, a power to begin to each and every people is the children of God. Our God is called to become each and every people to be a children of God. How it happen like that? But the people, those are believing in Jesus Christ, that time it will happen. God bless you. Okay, everybody. Come, I can pray for everybody. If you want to born again, I can pray for all of you. I'm preaching gospel, powerful gospel to each and every people. Praise the Lord. Today, no preachers are there in the city. Only I'm only preaching gospel. <laughs> By the Lord. So today, I want to say to each and every people, Jesus Christ is the light of the world. If Jesus Christ is the light of the world, God bless you. All the things, whatever it is coming against your life, our God can take away that one. Bible saying, Jesus Christ came to this world not to destroy the world but to get the everlasting life to each and every people. Here before, when I was preaching the gospel in the city, few people got, lots of people got saved. Around eight people got baptized from the city. Lots of people, they were homeless people and broken hearted people. Now, they are no more homeless people. They are no more broken hearted people. They are carrying the glory of the Lord in them. So today, the people are walking here. Only one good news, I want to say to each and every people, Jesus Christ is a way is a life and is a truth. Praise the Lord. Even if medical science rejected your case, sometimes you are in the point of the death. Bible is giving a healer name is called Jesus Christ. Only one God can able to heal not only your sickness, but spiritually and physically, what all the things which is coming against your life, our God can able to heal you. Praise the Lord. Bible says, the manifestation of Jesus Christ happened to destroy the work of the devil. Or can the satanic work? It was destroyed. By Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Okay, thank you. So today, when I preach this gospel, I preach this wonderful gospel. This gospel can get the life everlasting to each and every people. Not only the life everlasting for you, but eternal life for all the people. Those are believing in Him. Praise the Lord. So all the people are walking. Jesus Christ said, The people, those who are believing in Him, you are the new creation. New creation, that means the people are born again. You are all the thing. Everything, it has gone. Your old life, it is good from you. Our God has given to each and every people a new birth. New birth by Spirit of God. So that I want to say to each and every people, born again people are sitting in the heaven. I can pray for you. I want to pray. I can pray. No, no, no. Did I meet you sudden? Did I 
did I meet you certain citizen day? Did I meet you before? Did I did I meet you before? Make me pray. Did, did you see before? See you before? Yeah. No, I've never seen you before. First time. You want to pray? I can pray for you on the preaching gospel. Yeah, you can pray if you want. I don't mind. I'm not like no, no. Pray. If you want, if you are receiving Jesus Christ, He's your Lord and Savior. Uh, God can get eternal life. Yeah. No, I just I just think it gives an idea rather than an actual like. I just feel like. What, him as an idea to justify like hatred sometimes and like I don't know like I don't I believe the universe is conscious but I don't believe that there's like a specific deity and I also don't believe that any human text can truly represent the infallible nature of that universe. I'm not I'm not a preaching human test or anything. I'm preaching the heavenly God. He the heavenly realm about I'm preaching the heavenly realm of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ manifested in this world, that, that even better. if the human, but the birth of Jesus Christ happened by the Spirit of God. But that, that would, in my opinion, it would be earth that would be the heavenly realm. If you want, I, I can get you, I can uh, speak to you when I finish preaching, I can speak to you more. And uh, if you want, I can pray for you. I, I, I'm, I'm going to go around and do some shopping. Take care, no problem. Wish you a happy new year. God bless you. Bible says, what did John chapter 5, where this one Bible says, those who are in Christ Jesus, you are seated in the heaven. God bless you. Praise the Lord. All the people are born again. We are seated in the heaven. Praise the Lord. All the people are believing that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior. You are sitting in the heaven. Bible says, the wicked one cannot touch your body. So all the people are walking. I am preaching in this new year day. Only one God can get the protection to each and every people. That is Jesus Christ. Only one God can get life everlasting to each and every people. That is Jesus Christ. Say so today, before I finish my preaching, I am praying to the Lord in the city center. In the year of 2024, let a greater revival happen from the city to the nations. I am praying to the Lord. Father God, I pray for the city, for the revival of the city. Let all the people come to know you are the Lord in the year of 2024. I bless the city. Everybody, those who are walking, in Jesus' name, Amen. God bless you. Okay, thank you.